My name's Fred Toholsky and I'm here with the Gem City uh, Fly Tires Club and tonight what I'd like to uh, show you is tying uh, a version of a, uh, of a white streamer. Uh, this, uh, this particular streamer has uh, been very effective for me for uh, a lot of fish, steelhead, uh, bass, bluegills. I've caught perch on it fly fishing. So um, uh, let me show you how this is uh, done. Uh, what I'm going to be using tonight is a size 8 streamer hook. Uh, this one in particular is a TMC uh, 300. And uh, the mater other materials I'm going to be using is uh, white uh, a boa material. Uh, also a white marabou and uh, a little bit of uh, red yarn. Uh, the thread I'm going to be using is this one that I have here is a uh, number 8 uh, unithread. Uh, one of the first things that I do is, uh, oh, and I'm also going to be using some uh, white uh, yarn for body. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is, uh, I always bend the barbs down on these hooks. And putting that in the hook vise. And put a base of thread down on the hook. So white marabou, put that in for the tail, uh, about the length of the hook shank. Just cinch that down, cut the excess off. <clears throat> Take some boa material. Lay that in here. And we're going to take some white thread. Use this uh, more of a body filler so that you're not wrapping the boa on the, uh, the skinny hook shank. This kind of builds it up. You know, take the bow material and just wrap it around it. One of the things you want to try and do is to keep the bow material uh, facing towards the back of it. That way when it's working with the water it'll uh, kind of undulate and flow with uh, any current flows. If you put it on backwards it'll just uh, uh, flare out in the currents, but that's what you're looking for. You're looking for that to lay back. And the uh, last step is to take a piece of red yarn and tie that in as a throat. The red kind of gives the uh, fish uh, a target to shoot for. It's very attractive to the fish. One of the reasons that I've heard about putting a red throat on a fly is that sometimes a bait fish whenever it gets excited and tries to uh, swim away very fast it needs the oxygen so the gills open up and you see a little bit of uh, red in the gills and that that's uh, attractive uh, to the fish that's chasing it and then go ahead and do a whip finish and then a couple of times
like I said, this this little streamer has been very effective in any place where you're going to use a salted minnow. Just on a fly rod, and it's it's a very good, very good fly.